this video, I'm going to tell you about a very new and interesting device. This is a US FDA based device, which measures your sleep. So it measures sleep, it measures your breathing pauses, oxygen through the night, and also something called like your stress levels. So this is the device which is called as the Balon Ring. It is developed by a leading specialist from Hong Kong. So let's start that how do I use this device? So first you will get a couple of things when you get the device. This is the ring, this is the measuring tape, this is what is called as the cradle, and this is what is called as the charging cable. So when you get this, you open up the packet and you have something called as these numerous sizes, which you will get, which you will adjust to your finger size. So what to do, step number one is this is a measuring tape. So put it on your index finger and tighten it and you will see a number. So like I'm seeing a number seven. So that means my ring size is either going to be six or seven. So if this is the ring, and this, I can tell you, the numbers are written in very small digits here. This is number 10. So I want to show you what happens if I wear a number 10. So this looks as if it's okay, but it's kind of very loose. If it is very loose, the data will not be adequately recorded. The ring will tend to move at night. So the contact is not proper and the test will not be good. So what to do? So you hold it with hands like this and you just you are able to take this off. So these are the two parts which become separated. And now I look for a number seven or I look for a number six. So let's try number seven. I have fitted it again and you wear it on your index finger and see that it looks okay, but it's a little loose. So let me try a number six. So if I try a number six, so this is a ring, so you see, which is tight and this you have to wear the whole night. So once I have decided what my size is, you take it off and you put it, this is called as the cradle, you fit it in, you will hear this click, you press this button for a few seconds and you will see a red light has come in and this has become green and the ring is showing a red light. So this red light will be on through the whole night when you are wearing it. If you think it is not coming on, you can connect the charger to the point here. And this can go into any USB and this is, will be charged here. So once you wear it through the night, in the morning, you take it off. At night, if you need to go to the washroom, etc., you should make sure that this doesn't get wet. So please just take it off for that time and wear it again. And this is the red light that I was talking about. And then in the morning, you wake up and you put it back in the cradle and you press this again to turn it off. So it has gone off completely. And you pack up all the pieces that you have been given and you send it back to the clinic. Once it is back with us, just within a span of 10 to 15 minutes, we will get the data and communicate. So that video will be in another section that we will tell you what we see and what is the interpretation of this. I do hope that this will help people to follow these simple instructions. That this is a do-it-yourself it's not difficult at all and you can manage to record the breathing pauses and oxygen at night.